who is Melech Zadik? Mel Mel Melchizedek, as some of us say. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, was he Christ or was he a type of Christ? Please explain. I'm confused. Uh... You were talking about the king of righteousness. In the mystery of Solomon's labor, we go through the line of the order of Melech Zadik, the order of the king of righteousness, which is not based on fathers, not based on mother. It's not a Levitical lineage. It is a lineage that goes all the way back to Adam. And when you see the detail on this, you will understand why the Melech Zadik that came forth to, uh, to offer bread and wine to Abraham. Abraham responded by giving him a tenth of everything he owned. Uh, that was the king that came out of Jerusalem and is known uh, by, you know, in Jewish history as Shem. That is the righteous offspring of Noah. And you could say he's a type of Messiah, but it's literally that Yeshua is the high priest, the Kohen Gadol, forever after the order of the king of righteousness. It is a priesthood order that precedes and supersedes the Levitical priesthood. And this is what we deal with in Hebrews. In the entire series of Hebrews, you have to understand this because it's quoted over and over and over again. So make sure that you get the entire series, I believe it's 12 DVDs, on the book of Hebrews. Remember, Hebrews was written to Messianic Jews who were living at the time of the temple and living at the time that the Yom Kippur sacrifice was found to be ineffectual and terminated by heaven. You've got to get the, the Hebrews, and also the mystery of Solomon's labor, and then you'll get the full rest of the story.